Hello, Phoenix Union community, our staff, our students, and our families. Over the last two days, we have been busy meeting with leaders from all throughout the Phoenix Union community, determining the impact that Arizona's executive order will have on our plans to return to in-person learning in the month of March. As you are very likely aware, on February 22nd, we did announce that Phoenix Union would bring back an in-person learning option later in the month of March, in fact, on March 30th. And on February 22nd, we did release a registration link asking families to select either an in-person or a virtual learning option for the remainder of the school year in the fourth quarter. We encourage all of our families to continue to register for either in-person or virtual learning. That link does close later today. This week in Phoenix Union is preparation week. All of our administrators and several education support professionals have been busy once again cleaning and disinfecting our campuses making sure that our classrooms, our hallways, our cafeterias, our bathrooms, and all of our common spaces are ready for the return of our staff and our students. March 15th, that week, will be known as Safety Week in Phoenix Union. That is the day when we formally welcome back all of our 4,000 employees who are not already working from our sites. Just like we have the first, second, and third quarter, our teachers will launch the fourth quarter in a remote learning setting here in Phoenix Union. Our employees will also personally experience our safety procedures and protocols to ensure that we are fully ready for the return for our students in the month of March. Although our plan calls for the full return to in-person learning for families that selected that option on March 30th, any family per the executive order that wants to bring students back on campus on March 15th will be able to do so. We will welcome your students with open arms. The week of March 22nd in Phoenix Union will be known as Welcome Back Week. On Monday, we will welcome back our seniors. It'll be known as Senior Day. On Tuesday, March 23rd, will be Junior Day. That Wednesday will be Sophomore Day. And on Thursday and Friday, the 25th and the 26th of March, we will have two freshman days. We wanna make sure that the class of 20 24 has plenty of time to get resettled on campus. And on the week of March 30th, this week will be known as our launch week. It will be the first day in nearly a year where we welcome back every student and family member who chose in-person learning for the remainder of the fourth quarter. We're very excited for March 30th. Of course, for families that wish to remain in an all remote setting, currently at this point in time, 70 7% of our families have told us that they will choose to stay in a remote setting. We will continue to offer high quality virtual instruction for the rest of the school year. For more details about our return to in-person learning plans in the month of March, for more details about Arizona's executive order and the mandate to return on March 15th, and as well as all the details you need and want to know about our safety procedures and protocols, please visit our website www.pxu.org. As we have said many times, your health, your safety, and your wellness has and will continue to be our top priority. And we remain extremely grateful for your ongoing support, commitment, and trust in our leadership during these challenging times. I cannot wait to see all of you back on campus and in the community.